Hello everyone, this is Christopher Carrington from gmustudent.com. Today we are going to cover part one of the putting a YouTube video into shadow box effect. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, I'll show you a quick example here. Here we'll click the YouTube link, and as you will see, everything will black out around. YouTube will start loading right here. And immediately a YouTube video starts playing and you got the little title up here you have an X to get out of it here it is such a cool effect and it's so much above and beyond the typical just embedding it into your page or making a link to YouTube so in the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go into a web browser and type in shadowbox dash js com and once you come here you're going to see a download link so download this and make sure you click every single one of these little check marks and after you click them all come down and click zip file to download the zip file I've already downloaded it so after you do that you are all set to go now after you download that go to your finder and find out wherever you downloaded that file and open it so once you have it open in some kind of finder where you can see all the files in that folder that you just downloaded, copy all of the files. So highlight them all, right click them, and click copy 12 items. Then close that out. Now what you need to do is you need to paste those files into wherever your site is defined so that your site can utilize those files. So this is where my site is. I have it called First Site, and this is where my default images folder is. So I'm going to right click and I'm going to paste all of those items. Now my site is able to utilize all of these items. So after you've done all this, close this out and let's go into Dreamweaver. So open up Dreamweaver. And if you refresh this first site, you're going to see all of those files that I just pasted in there. So let's create a new HTML and let's go File save as sorry about that file save as try one more time and make sure you're where your site is defined and let's just call it shadow box underscore YouTube and save it so this is where we are going to make our cool effect so the first thing you need is you need to have either an image or you need to have text that is go that the user is going to click in order to see the YouTube video that you want so let's go to this is the image that I want my user to click in order to see my shadow box effect. So I'm going to right click this, save image as, and I'm going to go to my default images folder. I'm going to highlight all this and I'm going to say clickable underscore link and save it. So now let's go back to Dreamweaver and in Dreamweaver we are going to insert that image. So scroll down here and go to your image and click clickable link choose that image and click and type in click to see can't type today see YouTube video click OK so this is what our user is going to click in order to see our video so now let's insert the link to make that basically that thing go to the YouTube video that we want so click what if you have text highlight that text if you have a picture highlight that picture and go down to link and now we have to go find the uh, YouTube video so go to wherever your YouTube video is this is the YouTube video I'm going to use highlight that URL commander control C go back here and paste it and hit enter so now you have made this a link. In the next tutorial, we are going to learn how to make that link be a shadow box effect. So thank you for watching. This has been Christopher Carrington with GMUstudent.com.